Okay, so thank you so much, Dr. Stavitsky, and to all of our speakers today, um, including our, our uh, data blitz for uh, such informative and inspiring presentations. My heart is really filled with hope and excitement for the future of neuroscience and for the health and well-being of our community. Um, as we continue to gain a deeper understanding of how the brain works, and especially as we continue to work across disciplines, you've seen, you've heard of a lot of examples of collaboration today that make our work possible. We really believe that we're gonna be making continuing and increasing transformative discoveries that will allow us to identify new treatments and potential cures for these, these disorders across all of these different diseases that you heard about today. At the Center for Neuroscience and at UC Davis, uh, more broadly, we are deeply committed to this work and to improving lives. And we're really grateful for all of your continued interest and your support, and we look forward to partnering with all of you to uh, achieve this shared goal. So now I'd like to invite my co-chairs, Dr. John Gray and Costas Zarbalas, to come to the stage to join me in announcing the winner of this year's NeuroBlitz contest. And somebody is supposed to bring the envelope awesome. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we have a winner. Uh, and it is for the NeuroBlitz presentation, Lucas Cuya, by a very narrow margin. And I don't see him. See. Oh, okay. By the narrowest mar uh, margin imaginable, just one vote, but yet, <laughs> just by one vote. Here you go, and congratulations one more time. Terrific. So um, on behalf of the UC Davis Center for Neuroscience faculty, students, and staff, I want to thank all of you again for your participation, for joining us today. It's been great to be back in person. I can feel the energy. It's wonderful. We want you to stay healthy, and we look forward to hopefully seeing you again next year at next year's NeuroFest.